Hi, I'm Chef Wan and you are here today at D1 1958. We opened the restaurant three and a half months. Uh, has been an incredibly success. Oh, people just went crazy. Some fall dead. You know, some had heart attack. You know, the ambulance came. You know, that a bit drama lah. <laughs> it was hell. The first few days, I'm serious though, no? because there was no proper direction. I knew the team problem was going to come in because we were not ready in terms of having this huge crowd. So we had to go through that. Thank God for almost a week, and I start to hire more chefs and stuff. It just got better, and of course now we kind of like eliminate a lot of problem. Actually, when I first met uh, Andre, my partner, Andre said, "How do you want to position yourself, your food?" Initially, we wanted to do like very modern, but then I was thinking, you know, why go to that kind of like fine dining thing when we can't even perbetulkan makanan warisan kita? I mean, there's a lot of Malay food out there. The standard is really low quality. More and more young people are not interested to go into the kitchen anymore. And these days, people just one call got the grab, and then they spend more time on their own on social media in it thing, and then once in a while they get bored. They do selfie lah. Selfie tak biasa. Ah, uh, kat restoran pun duduk. Sometimes I say, can I take all the food here because all you have to eat. You have to eat. I think uh, this is where we are heading to. Sadly to say. So when I thought about it, I told my partner, let's focus more on the restaurant menu to be a bit more. I am entertaining you at my very own home. So that's why we have to make a menu, you know, really affordable for everybody. This is what uh, I feel. Uh, that makes the restaurant popular today. Uh, actually, with the banquet room, it's about 350, and up here we have another 150. So in total, between 400 to 450, we have done that before. In fact, Ramadan when we have our buffet and all that, there once a time I think the count was 550 people can organize events, wedding, special function, all that in our banquet room. We also have this wonderful 3D, the latest thing that people use uh, abroad, but not in Malaysia, but we are doing it where you can go in and have you know this wonderful experience. So we create the theme. For example, you want dining in the forest, and we turn everything to forest. You have insects. Sounds and things like that. You want to dine in in the ocean, so we can have on the wall all this marine life, all you know, turtle, fish, and all that, and even mermaid that look like Chef One. I'm here, I'm here. Chef One is here. So this is what I, 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 we're, we're putting all that. It's okay, you know, to come in with with little knowledge, uh, but then always come with an open heart. But you know, if you know your recipe is not tasty. Then go learn lah. Tekan one button, yo! Wow, on YouTube. In my time, we don't have that. We got to go to library, cari kubuk, and there even not a lot of kubuks. You have to knock the door. Aja lah saya, no pay bagi lima ringgit, no ringgit, tiga ringgit, no aja lah macam buat ni kan. You know, we have to go through that. So that's why I like to hire young chefs. These are the quality I'm looking. My staff and crew working really hard. My name is just a brand name. I aja recipe, but the rest is they the one who work super hard. So they the one who should earn recognition. Budak budak dari Taiwan, thank you. You have been the person, the driver. Force of what I am today. Mm -hmm.